It's not curling now, it is king. It seems like every four years, the sport tends to gain new interest and it's really become popular here in Minnesota. No surprise, Team Schuster all the way. We decided <laughs> to give it a try at a place that combines the sport with another favorite Minnesota pastime. Forgotten Star Brewing Company now calls this historic World War II production facility home, and they are producing some pretty incredible things here. Obviously, good beer, but it's more than just good beer. They are producing something that has everybody talking, and it's something you do well sipping that good beer. Let's go check it out. Yeah, that's right, ladies and gentlemen. It is part brewery, part curling center essentially <laughs> Andy is here the man behind the plan Andy okay what a great setup you guys have yeah here. we're super lucky you started obviously as a brewery I mean you still are then you had an ice rink and then you went to curling yep. was this the initial plan how did this come to be uh, it came to be out of necessity I mean uh, really COVID, COVID COVID forced our hand we need to create a pretty incredible out outdoor space last year that families would feel safe at so that's where the ice rink came in um, and then moving through last summer, I think, oh, what are we going to do next winter? We've decided we're just going to stick to two curling rinks, uh, really just focus on curling. We have curling leagues, we have curling tournaments, we have all sorts of fun stuff. Yeah, you guys have turned this into like quite the deal. I mean, you've got jerseys, yeah. you've got the two. I mean, these sleep, I, I'm not an expert, but these seem pretty <laughs> legit rinks. Yeah, so they're about half size what the Olymp Olympians use. Um, the stones are half the weight of what the Olympians use, and we, we call it bar curling, right? So just like uh, the professional dart players will use a very specific dart, we use, you know, our version. So a little, everything is about half the size, and we try to have a lot of fun with it. Are you a curler? I, I'm, not, I'm a beer drinker. I'm <laughs> okay. good at that. I'm not good at curling. Though. We have a lot of fun with curling. Uh, we raise a lot of money for charity with curling. We, um, yeah, we, it's really been our niche to fit into the community. Can you know? anybody come and curl? Yeah, so open curling is Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Uh, it's first come, first serve. We do allow people to re like make reservations that they want, but we, since we have so many rinks, we we'll always allow uh, a first come, first serve opportunity for people. Can I bring some of my friends? Well, I'd love it. Have fun. Let's do it. Thanks. Who better than an Olympic athlete in the sport of curling? This is Taylor Drees. Nice to see, I mean, you are the expert, so we were really lucky to have you. Thank you, I'm excited to be here. You've been doing curling for a long time, even though you look very young. <laughs> what brought you to the sport? You know, um, I'm from a small town in North Dakota, and we actually used to bring our gym class over to the curling club, and we'd do a month there, and that's just kind of grabbed on from there. And people are really getting into the sport. By the way, we've got to show the Team USA. She's, <laughs> yeah. All right. This These is upsetting. exciting. Yeah. People are really getting into this. I'm sure for you, that's that's a good thing, right? Yes, definitely. A lot of the pub publicity is really growing on the sport, um, and it's doing good things. So we need as much curlers out there as we can. And we need instructors and, <laughs> like you and coaches. And so l why don't you give us just some brief lessons on what we need to do because we don't I don't even know like that looks like a yeah so right here rock. yeah these are the, the rocks technology. yep stones rocks both are good um the objective is just to push them down as far as we can you want to get to the center this is the house and this is the button the closer to the center uh gets more points so that's okay. what we want to do and we have two sweepers here over there so they'll okay. <laughs> yep exactly they're gonna brush down the ice get the rocks moving you want to grab the handle if you're right-handed and give it a big push. You gotta, might be a little light. Yep, you really gotta give it a push. <laughs> okay. medals we got we're so we're so good okay now these are actually medals for their beer but you know what I feel like we earned a medal and we're probably gonna be Olympic bound just like Taylor Dries someday so to that thank you cheers. and a uh, big cheers, cheers. 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 nice curling. work guys nice work cheers. Cheers. <laughs> I... Alex I have to give you credit because you went into it you had you had a little bit of a back issue mm -hmm. and you were like I'm not sure and she got the furthest throw in the long run you did you got the furthest one well I, I can't exactly say I have style points in that but thank you for <laughs> that uh, the one funny thing that we didn't capture uh, that you didn't see was I when you when I threw it or actually when you threw it and I needed to sweep for you you're my sweeper. I just stood there and I was like wow <laughs> and James like where are you where was my sweeper she just watched it go by it is sometimes funny when you watch stuff back and you think you look 
pretty yeah. good. Mm -hmm. And yes. so maybe we didn't look so hot. <laughs> and the tape never lies. <laughs> the tape never <laughs> lies. Okay, the brewery, by the way, is having a big curling tournament this weekend. More than 100 different curling teams are competing. We are not one of them, but <laughs> they will have live bands, food, and of course, beer. So go check it out. And, you know, maybe we need to redeem ourselves another time. It sounds like fun, though. <laughs> it does really, sound fun. Uh, we should. We should it was a good improve time. our skills and and drink beer <laughs> and drink beer first <laughs> and then improve yes. our, yeah that would be I'd love maybe to we do did that. it in the wrong order That's I think that was it Kelly and maybe a little bit you know, a little looser, looser. yeah <laughs> <laughs> all right uh, still to come skin sisters give us the lowdown on Botox Botox the benefits the risks and more and as we did to break obviously you just saw us curling so if you want to give it a try you can pause your screen right there or take a quick look here, write down the information, head to ForgottenStarBrewery.com. Again, they have open curling times. As always, the full story and links will be available on the Fox 9 Good Day Facebook page just a little bit after the show. Stay with us.